Welcome back to Design Para Sa Lahat. You're on Design Discovery. Welcome back to Design Para Sa Lahat. I'm your designer host, Brian Tenorio. And we are here right now in our discovery segment na kung saan titignan natin ang naggagandahang furniture na gawa sa Cebu. I've been to a lot of places and when I travel around, I've seen a lot of really cool rocking stuff. And I wonder when I see them, saan kaya gawa mga pagay na ito? And guess what? Some of them are made here in the Philippines and some of them are designed even and produced in Cebu. And wait for it later because we have an exclusive one-on-one -on -one interview with design icon Kenneth Cobonpe. As a designer myself, ako nga excited na excited na makita ang kanyang workspace, ang kanyang factory at malaman kung paano siya mag-isip, paano siya ma-inspire as a designer. So Arena, that's Halika in Cebuano and join me as I show you all the designer furniture made in Cebu. So tignan mo naman, inspiration pa lang, Pinoy na Pinoy na. This one, these lamps or inspired from puso or hanging rice here in Cebu. Yung original puso, may rice sa loob, tas gawa siya coconut leaves. Makikita mo yung style niya, it's actually just made out of two materials, metal ringlets, and then you have this really nice clear plastic na translucent. Tignan nyo, ang ganda ng dating. So simple lang yung materials, napakaganda ng design because magandang pinaghuhugutan and that is your inspiration from the Philippines. Wow! At hindi lang pang international ang designs ng Cebu, pang intergalactic din. Tignan mo naman ang mga designs sa mga furniture pieces and accessories na ito. Look at that. These are lamps. And look at the way there's a cracked effect on the edge. And look at also the way they look here. There's talons and there's these nice oval shapes. So, kahit regional, international, or intergalactic, ang kailangan mong gawin na designs, kaya nila gawin ito sa Cebu. Kung pagod na pagod ka na sa kakabiyahe at kakatingin sa mga naggagandahang designs, pwede kang makiupo sa mga designer chairs na gawa at styled sa Cebu. Katulad nito, very classic shape, very classic treatment and weaving. Patig na mo naman, modern na modern at very contemporary pa rin ang dating. Ilang saglit lang at magbabalik ang design para sa lahat. Welcome back to Design Para Sa Lahat. You're in design para sa lahat with your designer host, Brian Tenorio. Here right now in Cebu, ngayon i-discover naman natin ang isang designer mind. Isa sa pinakamagaling sa mundo sa furniture also, Kenneth Cobonfe. Kenneth, thank you for having us. Thank you. Thank Hi, Brian. You. Thank you. Thank you. What are your best practices when it comes to design? I think uh, design uh, is really a discipline, actually. No? Uh, Pag-isip natin design, it's a flash of uh, inspiration or a bolt of lightning. But actually, design is really hard work, meaning I set aside uh, time for it, you know, maybe an hour each day, and I really force myself to come up with something new. You know? oh. uh, sometimes meron, sometimes wala, you know? then nothing comes about. The more you do design, the faster it becomes to transform something from inspiration to the final object. How can design improve our lives, lalo na sa mga everyday na bagay na bu sa buhay natin? Yeah, oh. People think that it's uh, parang window dressing. Actually, what is the definition of design? No? Para sa akin, design is a solution to a problem. So, to me, um, if it doesn't solve a function like uh, hindi siya comfortable uh -huh. or uh, it doesn't work, to me, that's not good design. And so, design is a matter of uh, systemizing our, our lives to make us uh, feel better you know, okay. and also to live our lives better. What are your tips, uh, Kenneth, for aspiring designers, for young designers out there who feel like they want to try out designing? Before coming up with something, ako, I always think, what is my contribution to the world? And if it's not, to me, not, not unique and not very original, then I don't do it. And I think it's up to us to look into our culture and to find something there because that's something that's unique in us. But you know, in today's world, Okay, and this is different from when I was a student. No? Ngayon, if I make something, you know, because of uh, media and online, the whole world sees it right away. And so now it's very fast to get your ideas across, which is very different from before. Thank you very much. We are extremely, extremely lucky to actually have in an insight on the designer mind of Kenneth Cobonpe and his workspace and his designs also as we go on through our episode, Design Para Salat for Philippine Design Week 2012.